record this for him as well. And okay. um, so let's see. So you were playing as white. I think all my markers are gone for this too. This really, well, let me see. Yep, all my markers are gone. Oh, wow. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I, uh, OGS is acting up today because because earlier it, it was acting up. I had a, another OSR game earlier this afternoon and it was acting weird. When it wouldn't, like my moves wouldn't even register in the beginning. I had to like, re, like log out, log back in again for it to work. I wonder, okay. I wonder if I mm -hmm. like reload it. Let me try and reload it and see if it comes up. Mm, nope, that's awful. Mm. Oh, here we go. Here's some of them coming back, oddly enough. Yeah. They don't have it for move 13, but that's okay. All right. So I'll just, I just, you know, I'll use my notes here and then I'll try and okay. remember everything. Um, so for a move 13 for Marty, <clears throat> the Joseki should be this one first. Mm -hmm. So we push, then we stand up. And the reason being is because it creates these weaknesses here, right? Right. Um, and then we play this, and then we jump. And so this is the Joseki. And then white can choose to play somewhere else, or white can play as you did. Um, but that is, you know, the Joseki. And for Marty, he played here which this was the AI recommended move, but it also gives you the option to play here. Though this is better still, because obviously if you played this, this would be really good for black. So this was good for you, Chip. And then he did stand up. So it's looking like a different order, but it's coming out the same way. Just like in mm -hmm. your game, right? You did a different order, but it, it's coming out the same way. Right. Um, but then he played here and this is bad. So. Uh, he needed to jump because he so for Marty uh, you got three stones the rules are if you have three stones then you can jump and the, the reason you jump is because you need to get in front of your opponent you need to get ahead of them right um, if you just stay behind then it's not good for you um, which happened in the game so at this point he played away um, but this group actually isn't alive yet um, so there's a lot of danger hidden here and um, unfortunately you didn't attack it as well so mm -hmm. the whole game like the computer's just screaming you about the same moves for the next like 80 moves <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah so for Marty Marty should have attacked here and then um, even once you just play like this right like if you connected here well, then he can Atari and Atari and then just kill these three stones, right? Right. Um, so, and if you played like this or this or this, um, well, then he can not only threaten to come under here to make sure that you don't have a base still, but uh, also when he takes this stone, these stones start to become in some danger, right? Yeah. Uh, so now you'd have two weak groups. You'd have group A and group B. And so you'd have to worry about both their safety. Mm -hmm. um, so, Marty, one, you should jump when you have three stones. And two, this is the next logical move um, to really hurt this white group. Because either way, it's going to hurt white. So that's why when y you played here... You didn't answer, right? You immediately like, oh, you did answer. I th I thought you slapped down right here, but yeah. So you, you did get the move anyway, right? Mm -hmm. And I'm sure you knew that because you didn't want to get cut up here, right? Right. Um. Right. So uh, that's that really. <laughs> so yeah. the idea is that this is a weak group. So Marty, you should have played one more move to make it stronger. Um. For Marty, uh, you know, a one jump here would probably be the best. Or the second best. The first best is this one. So that's that. For you, Chip, um, I didn't think this was a bad move. I probably would have even considered playing it myself. Um, but the computer really liked this one and this one. 
and mm. they're both really cool um this one in particular you can see is very damaging to this group and then it's also sealing black right so even if yeah. black lives he's going to be sealed in um and this one was considered the better one because when black responds in any sort of way um now you can really turn here and uh take this group apart right there's a uh this doesn't look like enough for him to live right we have um a very simple bulky five here um so we can check that with the ai after um but i okay. thought but this uh this surprisingly like had better options right like this is nice because it puts pressure on black here and mm -hmm. it's helping this cut right because now yeah. you can see you know this isn't as bad right you can still get out if he plays this way you can romeo juliet so there's too many weaknesses here for um there to be a problem for white yeah. so that was cool um, ba, 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 ba. So, yeah, the computer is just screaming every single move for black to play either A or C. The computer for you is screaming to play here. Um, mm -hmm. And this is going this is going on for like the next like 60 moves. Um, so just what I really want you to remember is, you know, if the group on the I wrote left side, I meant the right side. Uh, if this group isn't settled, which it isn't, then Marty should be focusing on saving it and making it settled. And for you, if you feel this group is weak or unsettled, then you should be on the attack, right? Attack the weak group, way of the warrior. Right. Mm -hmm. So even though like the, the corners have some value, of course, um this is huge. Like if you kill this, this is worth like double points because of the kill, right? right um and even if he has to respond right like even if he lives is what i mean um you will defeat you know surround him in sente and so mm -hmm. then you get your your cake and you get to eat it too right you get both of the best worlds um so definitely 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 if you see a weak group you want to uh, push on it and put pressure and attack it and seal yeah. it up um, so this was a big missed opportunity for both of you guys for a, a long time. Um, so for white, um, you turned here, but it should be here. Um, can he answer you now? Can he play something like this? Um, I mean. I mean, he can play something like this, but what, I mean, does this look bad for white right now? No, I mean, I could always play, yeah, E10 and be mm -hmm. fine. Yep, you can attack this to your heart's delight, right? Yeah. And then later, you can, uh, once the fighting's over, you can come back and play something like this, right? Um, yeah. Which really damages this area, right? This means that black's going to make, like, no points here. Um, so this move would have gotten you a lot stronger. And mm -hmm. if he was to play something like this, well, you can still play here. And if he continues to cower, well, now you have more than enough to make a, a net, right? Right. And so this doesn't, you don't have to worry about this. So he should play here. You should play here. And then it becomes a, a big fight, right? Like it becomes a running battle. Which is good right. for you because you have a wall here and a wall here. So you have all the strength in this area, which means you can bully these stones and either kill them or you can make territory, right? Yeah. Um, but yeah, so this, this turn felt really wrong to me. Um, this was good. This was really bad uh, for Marty. So what did you think when you saw this move, uh, Chip? Um, <clears throat> I knew he was going the wrong direction because then I can, um, go after his weak spot on the lower edge, which I think I did. This lower edge or? Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah yep, yep. Like M3, yeah. Yeah, this felt like the wrong direction. Um, mm -hmm. So one, it's on the fifth line, right? Yeah. So that's already like pretty awkward in itself. Um, mm -hmm. Two, it's not really attacking this group. You know, if you mm -hmm. were going to attack this group, you'd probably want to play something like this, right? And then right. Uh, um, maybe uh, not even this one doesn't work as well, but uh, something like this um, to make sure that white stays a stick and has very little eye shape potential, right? right? But even then, this is very strong, so I wouldn't even try attacking it right now. Um, but yeah, this is wrong. So um, first of all, we know that this group can be killed, so this needed to be saved. Um, second, this group can still run out, right? This is white can't catch black. This is a one turn game, right? Like, so, you know, this isn't going to work per se in this, uh, in this situation. And so, um, white has the freedom to come out and if white makes a mistake, well, now you can really damage these stones, but, right. um, Marty missed out, but this one's the most important. Uh, and then this would be second. But this move just doesn't feel right. It's not really putting any pressure. It's definitely not building any points. Uh, this feels like a floating move to me. Yeah. Um, but this move was too slow, right? Uh, to me, it felt slow. I understand that, yeah, black can come out. But even so, like even if you chase this now, um, you you'll essentially be building... Uh, influence facing upwards right mm -hmm. and you have a nice wall here so making influence facing here is not a bad idea um, plus while he's running um, you can poke at this and then start using your influence for below right to make points below yeah. So <laughs> even though I said this is good for Marty it's like it all depends on who's going to mess up in the fighting right if you right. mess up in the fighting, then he's going to get a really good time. If he messes up in the fighting, then it could be equal or it could be devastating, depending on how bad it is. Um, but yeah, anyway, this was the move. Uh, so this was really, really, really bad. Um, I don't know how much of a negative move it was. We'll check the AI after. Uh, but this uh, was too slow. Um, so that, that, that was my whole point, right? Was... Um, you know, if you played something like this or, yeah, something like this, you, you could potentially kill all this. And if you're worried about him coming out, I mean, that's okay. As long as you, you know, pay attention to what you're doing, then you, you're not going to die, right? And you're going to build influence. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so, yeah, that was big. And this was slow. Um, so this was good. My, I think Mari did a good job uh, neutralizing your wall here. Uh, this is okay. Feels a little slow, but it's okay. I understand that, you know, now that he's taking this, you don't want him to take this too, right? Because this would be right. painful. So I understand the sentiment here. Um, this was bad. Uh, Black could have easily played here, and there's uh, you know, there's no consequences mm -hmm. for Black playing this way. So Black could have took more here, Marty. Um, oh, but anyway, he shouldn't have, um, black should have been looking down here. So he neutralized this wall, which makes it very hard for you to make territory here. Now he can come over here, right? And neutralize this wall. Um, so this is what he should have done so that that's the direction of play we should be looking for. Um, but Anyway, yeah, so that was the problem with Marty's move here, uh, especially here. This is too low, too slow, and then you got the move here. So now you're doing pretty good. Um, since he had these two stones, I might have considered counterattacking like this. Um, he could he can fight you a little stronger uh, because he has the two stones here, but uh, he played very softly and allowed you to make the points which was okay for him too he's breaking up this area but as we know he needed one more move to connect this so right. this was good but then he needed to play like something like this yeah. because now the the connection can't be broken right right this uh, this networks 
And so this cut isn't something to worry about here. Um, so everything's well connected. So if he played this move, I honestly, and you kept messing this, like, uh, you know, let's say you played somewhere else, right? Like something here, mm -hmm. and then he played this. I think Marty actually would have won this game um, because you made a lot of walls, but you didn't get to use them. You know right. what I mean? Yeah. Um, so, you know, you look at Marty, he's got a good territory here. It's low, but still solid here. Um, so solid here. And then he broke up this area, right? This was the scary mm -hmm. area. And mm -hmm. now it's broken up. So yeah. this would have been good for Marty, but uh, he missed this connection. And then that was pretty much why he lost. So, you know, he did really well here. And then right there, that's when you... You played the A-class move, and uh, you won the game at this point. Yeah. Uh, because once you get all this, this is pretty big. And with the kill, right, you were able to um, kill this group. Yeah, it's game over now. So he was correct. Uh, I know around, like, you know, uh, I want to say it was around here. He said that, you know, uh, I told him, you know, he shouldn't give up on his games, but he wanted to resign and he, he's kind of right if he can't make eyes here then he should resign yeah. <laughs> but yeah. um but yeah it was unfortunate with this misconnect for him but super fortunate for you chip so you know <laughs> uh yeah so i think i mean you did a good job coming back here you were you were able to use your strength um because that's what walls are, right? Like, they're, they're, they're strength. Mm -hmm. And you're supposed to use them for fighting. So once you were able to get the opportunity to fight, you did an excellent job of, um, you know, taking control of the fight and then winning it, right? So yeah. I didn't really see any holes here where Black could change it around. And I don't think the computer did either. Okay. So we'll just look very quickly at the, the biggest mistakes. So this one, we talked about it for Marty, where uh, he should have played A. And you mm -hmm. can see once he plays like this, now it's telling White to play down, um, which is actually trying to like take this area and kind of abandon these stones. And so what we see is an exchange here. So white gets a, a very solid group facing his stones. Mm -hmm. And then um, black gets a very solid corner here. Okay. I prefer this for black, to be honest. But uh, mm -hmm. at this point, it's saying that it's an even result. Uh, but that's because uh, this is good for black. And then he didn't choose the good move, right? And so now it's not even for for you guys now you're in, right. in the lead okay um so this uh and once again uh, when i was doing the review i i said that i thought you played over here immediately right um mm -hmm. but yeah so anyway responding here was bad because this area is so important gotcha. so even if you responded with the move that you planned to um this would have been good for you because these stones could die right that's the point right okay. um but to show you the better move than playing here pretty much um get i think i think i actually showed this out pretty well when i did it i'm glad because i wasn't 100 percent sure but it looked right so um you can see that white gets more strength just with this one move mm -hmm. and then it allows you to fight both sides Okay. Alright. So, so now every move is bad because this group was could be killed. And that's why I was telling you, right. like for the next 80 moves, the computer's just telling you here. Um so everything's gonna be these moves. Right. Uh even now, right? So like I yeah. said, he should have jumped <clears throat> or played this to save this. And you should have played here to kill it. So, yeah. um, and this just goes on and on and on and on. So, anyway, I hope that uh, helps um, for both of you guys. Um, 
I guess is there any so from uh, for Marty uh, the advice was easy right you, you just have to um, keep an idea of your connections right mm -hmm. um, you know this move felt out of place anyway right now so uh, you know that's just that so but for you, you Marty uh, you just had to keep an eye on your connection if you were able to connect here I think uh, you would have won this game because you know where's white's points right now i don't see really any group of points for white right yeah maybe that lower edge but that's it yeah th this is it and then even then um it could be taking away right like yeah. a good portion yeah. of it anyway right um so uh so for marty that that was a very simple truth for you chip um let me see why you got into such a bad situation then i think slow moves yeah well not slow moves in particular i think uh yeah i mean this this was unnecessary right now so right now mm -hmm. you should have been uh playing something like this to try and make as much territory as you can Mm -hmm. or something over here right to try and make as much territory as you can so this this was a little slow um but yeah it's uh like when when was your opportunity right to do these things uh so this was big i guess uh because this would have been a whole different game right um this was really slow. Right, right, right. I'm glad <laughs> you you picked up on it better than I did, right? I, I said it in the review, but um, I forgot. So, yes. Um, so your problem for Chip, like what we can take away from this game is one, um, if there's a weak group, even if you don't think you can kill it, I mean, just sealing this alone, like I said, would have been so big, right? Like, let's let's pretend this lived. This isn't alive, by the way. If you play here, this isn't alive. But let's pretend that, you know, it, Black lives here, right? Um, just sealing it is good enough for you, especially if you get Sente. Yeah. So that's something you can uh, really, like, work on looking at this game. The other thing, too, like like I said, this was really slow. Right now, you really should be focused on like trying to make use of these big walls um, mm -hmm. and make as much territory as possible. Uh, but instead, you played a very, very slow move for only two stones when uh, you could have gotten like this area or any of the other areas, right? right. Uh, same with this. This uh, is a little too slow right now because um, this territory is very open, right? Like Black will be able to take away your potential here. So. Right. Uh, instead of letting him do that, you could, you know, make it so that he can't, right? <laughs> yeah. That's the best way I can put it, right? Like, you could see that this would be much more beneficial than um, uh, this move here. Because he right. just takes it all away. Yeah. So, um, it was a mix of slow moves and just not picking your timing on direction of play, right? Like, <coughs> these yeah. these areas should have been the main focus for both you guys and uh you missed them and then he got one and he should have got the other one but um but you got it but then because he had the stone here he could flatten you out a bit so it, it's very interesting dynamic so this is another uh thing too is like not to play too close to thickness right so yeah. if you played something like this or yeah, it's not as good, but like he can't counterattack you, right? You just win this fight. Right. Um but I did like this move cuz it breaks the dog's face. So I still like this move. <laughs> yeah. But all right. Um so that's good. All right, Chip. Uh so in both games we could really find some slow moves that you could work on. So mm -hmm. ideally you want to stay away from the ground. Um so the, this was the ground, right? Like we're on the, the lowest level, the level one, right? And so we right. want to stay away from these unless it involves life and death. If this somehow killed this whole group, then go for it. But if it doesn't, then uh, it's not worth it. And so we should 
always make sure that he can't manipulate you if you have two liberties. Um, and then for this game, uh, it was killing stones that wasn't needed, right? Like, mm -hmm. these stones don't really matter at too much. They matter some, but not too much. And so, like, killing these instead of taking this is much more... We can see the yeah. value of this being, like, maybe 20, 30 points, whereas this right. is worth four, right? So yeah. A big, big, big difference in points. But okay, okay. I'll end it here. Um... Thank you.